Jim Holly, Supercross Live on supercrossonline.com. Well, welcome to this week's Toyota Tailgate Talk. The man standing next to me from Toyota, Rick Humphreys. Uh, Rick, you know what? This is a Toyota Tailgate Talk, so let, let's let's put this tailgate down and let's jump up on here and we'll do the interview here. There you go. What do you think? I think we can make this happen. You can do it. Hey, Toyota, they've been around a long time in, in Supercross and everything, and uh, I want you to talk a little bit about the differences between the 2012 and the 2013 that we are sitting on. Well, the uh, actually what's come, this is the 2013 and we got the 14 coming out. Uh, the 14 will come out in probably September, October, and uh, the differences are pretty dramatic uh, from a from a visual standpoint. Uh, it's gone more angular, it's more uh, uh, more rugged looking, but really where the home run is is on the interior. Uh, it's by far, uh, having looked at all the vehicles, having driven all the vehicles, the interior by far is without a doubt the best, most uh, uh, comfortable in terms of uh, premium features, all that, the interior is just unbelievable. Talk a little bit about the, the flex fuel uh, that Toyota has. I know they use ethanol. Uh, you know, Toyota's always innovating. You know, it says, uh, you know, let's go places. Well, you know, flex fuel is, um, is, is an important part of the, uh, the whole fuel and EPA kind of an approach that we've got. And uh, all of our four-wheel drive Tundras are flex fuel capable. Uh, there's some changes that have to be made to the vehicle to run flex fuel because of the ethanol, because it's 85% ethanol and only 15% gasoline. So there's some changes that have to be made to the fuel tank and fuel lines and injectors and that sort of thing. So, But there are some areas in the country that are real dependent upon ethanol. So we do have to be able to provide that kind of a vehicle. And it typically is four-wheel drives. And uh, it's, uh, it's an important part of our whole uh, MPG green campaign. Rick, something else that, you know, these two trucks that we have here at Supercross, I mean, these guys, these things are tricked out. I mean, in fab, you know, they're all, you know, raised rims, everything. I mean, they're custom yeah, trucks. Yeah. yeah, these these are the kind of trucks that we want the, 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 the Supercross fan to see. And uh, certainly Thomas Victor at NFAB really knocks it out of the park on these trucks, you know, lifted with the light bars and, and all of the different things, the wheels and the, uh, you know, hey, it doesn't get any better this. Thomas and the guys at NFAB, um, they're the benchmark for uh, uh, truck modifications. Now, they, I got to admit, they do more than just Tundras and Toyotas, but uh, for us, he's the guy. And uh, you can tell by the way they look, the fans love him. Uh, uh, Todd Gendro had one out there yesterday at Three Palms. Everybody was looking at the truck because it is so absolutely stunning. Something else you guys are busy at uh, here in Houston, uh, Three Palms MX. Uh, you hosted, Toyota hosted a mountain bike ride on Thursday, and then on Friday you follow that up with uh, everyone, you invite a lot of the industry people to come out and, and just kind of in a relaxed atmosphere, go out and have fun on a motorcycle on Friday. Well, you know, we're just trying to figure out a way to find a way to pay back you guys. You know, everything that you do that helps us. So, yeah, we're a sponsor, but it's about that partnership that we've got with Feld and with you and everybody involved in Supercross. And uh, this was really our way seven years ago with uh, Scotty Lalonde, Podium Marketing. It was really a way for us to all get together on a Friday and have a little bit of fun without all of the work and all of the other stuff that goes along with it. And um, it, has, um, it has gone crazy. And uh, yesterday at Three Palms Action Sports Park, we had probably 75, 80 riders, and we can't keep them away. They they are beating on the door to come in. And uh, but Thursday we did the, the first annual day in the park. We rode over Memorial Park, and it rained a little bit on Wednesday, so it really uh, it was a lot of fun. And uh, maybe the mountain bike uh, day might uh, become a little larger than we ever thought. So mountain bikes, motorcycles, hanging out with Jim Holly, uh, it's, it's doesn't get any better. All right, well, you heard it from Rick, the man from uh, Toyota, Rick Humphreys. That's it for this week's Toyota Tailgate Talk. Make sure you check us out on supercrossonline.com Wednesdays at 5 p.m. on that East Coast. And don't forget about Thursday nights after the checkered flag with Ralph, Ricky, and Jeff.